The crucible is a small pot which contains molten wax and allows fluid lines, drips and pouring. The stand needs to be shaped. So bend up the side pieces to hold the crucible in position. And then to avoid drips, bend it backwards so that when it's seated, the pipe is above the wax inside the crucible. Attach it to the stylus by screwing, and if you turn the handle of the stylus, then remember to unravel so the cable is perfectly straight. Then switch it on to the top heat, setting two. Take pieces of wax, sit it on the stand, and smash or break the wax into small pieces that fit inside the pot. They take a few minutes to melt together. This is a rigid board. It's rigid. And that's important because as we build up a thicker layer of wax, any flexing could crack that wax. So ideally work onto a rigid surface, especially if you're going to build up any depth. Once molten, just apply the tip of the pipe and set off. Fluid lines are very simple. Spots are easy, and filling areas is quite straightforward as the wax flows out whilst you move that tip around. If the crucible is sitting tilted too far towards the pipe, wax will drip out, and then you'll get deposits onto the surface of the stand. So make sure you tilt it back enough when you set it up. When you're working, you can pick up deposits on the end of the pipe. This is congealing wax, so just wipe it off with a piece of tissue. And you may find that you have to tap the end to get it to start flowing again. Now you can over paint, you can build up layers of application. Depths in the spots. Quite thick applications of wax are possible this way as you build up areas. And that's why rigid support is vital. If this was flexed, then the thicker areas could easily crack. Of course, you can drip with the pipe when the wax is hot enough. And you can dribble it and then work it with other tools. Brushes, rubber brushes, combs. And to clean the crucible, just take a tissue, put it inside, rotate and that'll take out the worst of the wax and then you can add some more. Now the hot plate allows great work with the crucible. As the wax is applied, it immediately levels out. It's a self-leveling liquid. So for filling areas, it's wonderful. Just keep working with the end of the pipe moving as the wax flows out to fill the area. Of course, you can apply colour in the normal way on a hot plate and then work with the crucible over that. And you'll see that the little spots flatten out into much larger areas very quickly. It's a lovely tool for melting and pouring.